promotes from this music so I'll discuss something on the techniques of guitar might be those who have been already learning and playing they know it but I'll go more a little bit more into the details that how it will affect your playing that you will have a, a better time in guitar if you adopt these techniques <clears throat> first of thing how to hold a pick that's the way but it's important like you should make a curve here right if you don't make a curve like if you can hold it like this so it will affect your whole position guitar so that's the only way to hold a pick <laughs> Holding like this, more grip, more command in your right hand. Right, and some people uh, also hold like this, which is not good. You know, your thumb should be flat while holding guitar, holding pick. And some of them, all those who have been learning on their own, sometimes they can hold like this, which is not good. But that's the only way to make a curve. Even sometimes when we start teaching the beginners. We told them, okay, hold like this. But when they start playing on the first, second string notes, when they start progressing, again, this their their position start coming coming like this. So then we have to keep telling them again and again that you know that's a way to hold a peck. Okay. The second thing, <clears throat> the placement of your right hand, right? That's the part which is lifted here from right your elbow should start coming here like and have a connection of the bridge right? some people are holding like this or like this which is not good that's the way have a connection on the bridge and I never play with like a floating like when, when you don't have a connection if, when you have a connection then you know that then you have more command where your strings are you get more references like <laughs> reference all your strings so that's the way sometimes I can understand you know if you are if you are if you if you have uh, some small guitar like this is a classical guitar it's like a 39 inch or 40 inch like not 41 so your hand maybe can go like this that's that understood but not even like this or like this still here <laughs> Even for, even for like, uh, for a classical, even when you're playing electric, the same thing. Like you know, you have on the on the bridge, not like this from the down. Okay, because when you um, when your hand is here, then you have a more command on bass string, because guitar is a Western instrument, and you got to have a, you got to play the Western music on this, because sometimes the players are playing some Bollywood. They can manage like from from the down, but if you're playing Western music, you should have a more command on your bass string. That's that's the position. Because when you're here, then how can you manage here, right? So that's very important that you hold it down like this, <clears throat> have a connection on the bridge. And some children even also complain that, sir, when we are placing our palm on the bridge, so it's muting the string. Maybe, but I'm not saying that you're going to fix here. You can move a little bit, right? If you feel like it's buzzing here, you can put a little back, a little up. 
when you start patterning, you will find the right place, you know, where should your palm should be, so that the string should not be muted. <laughs> Okay, so that's the, your right hand placement. It should be like this, not like this, or not like this. Okay, the third thing, <clears throat> your left hand position. Guitar is all about playing with your tips, right? Even I, in my guitar journey, I come to know very late, you know, guitar is all about playing with the tips. I'll have a good time when I start playing with the tips. It's not playing with this section or tip. Because when you're playing with the tips, then you only be able to get a good sound and you can play the multiple notes, like you can play chords. And your other strings are not muted. If you're not playing with the tips, then start buzzing. When you start, start buzzing. Might be for the children, sometimes they they say that's okay sir from when we're playing from this this section it's easy and we, when we're playing from this section it hurts it's nothing like that maybe a little little bit uh, not good time with the with the uh, tips but when you start practicing it will start coming you, then you will have definitely a good time on guitar. So make sure you're playing with your tips, not the, not this section, right? Okay. And <clears throat> one more, uh, the very basic technique, like you, your finger should be sustained. Your finger should be down maximum. We know that this is chromatics we are playing. And we're playing chromatics. So my fingers are, I'm not taking off my other fingers while playing other notes. They're down. So this, this technique should be, should be adopted for all your playing. Like when we start playing the first string note, like we're playing off to joy. So I'm holding F and playing G. I'm not doing like this. For the whole life, your fingers are flying. Guitar is playing finger down maximum. You can see the professional how they're playing. The fingers are down maximum. They're not having flying fingers. Okay, and you must have seen this 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 instruction in your books also, even in Alfred, even in Harlunath. Alfred, Alfred is telling like in your if you can see the page number. Page number nine, the part like the question is still more. They're putting arrows here, right? They're putting arrows. This arrows means like when you're playing F, let your finger down. Playing from F to G. Even in, in Harlow, they have they have mentions like they have they've written. They have written here. Hold first finger down. That's that, that's the same meaning. That's a very basic technique. Like your your finger should be down maximum while playing guitar. Right. One another thing <coughs> of your thumb position, like it should be here. Like you know, even this question come in the Trinity in the second second grade. I think they ask you that what is your uh, left hand position in guitar. You got to tell them like this. So your thumb should be backing with the second finger like this and it should not be like this it's going down like this and not like this this is fine sometimes it can go up and down like if I'm playing D chord it goes up when I'm playing G chord it go down that's fine but not like this or not like this right okay so that's uh, one more um, technique Sometimes I see the children's, they are, sometimes they go very bad, like here. They, they are playing from here. The, the 
sound is not balanced here. You should at least target here. Guitar is designed in that way when you're playing from a little bit in your sound hole, the, your sound is balanced. Soothing. It's not balanced. You're doing bad sometimes. You're not playing from here. You don't have a good sound when playing this. Well, that's come in the uh, Trinity slavers like that's a pont, like sometimes you go to play back. But that's another different thing. But normally, you should target that you should play just near the sound hole. So, this, so the, the sound should be balanced. Okay. Can adopt these techniques definitely you'll have a good time in guitar playing you will start enjoying your guitar more it might be a little difficult at the beginning when you start adopting the right techniques like naturally it's come like this okay we hold like this or like the, you can hold like this in the pick in the beginning right so hands so but when you start adopting the right techniques you will, you will start you will start enjoying your guitar playing. That's all. Thank you very much.